Hey guys, Alex Branning here with Veronica Griffith. Today is Funnel Friday. Happy nope. Friday. <laughs> <laughs> we are talking about how to use funnels to grow your network marketing business. Mary Kay, Unique, Arbonne, LuLaRoe, etc. So we're going to talk about how to find willing and excited prospects mm -hmm. using a giveaway funnel. Um, go over what the heck is a giveaway right. funnel. <laughs> right. um, and then I'm going to talk briefly about how to use webinars to get a prospect to go from being interested to closing the deal. So we're gonna talk about that. Let's start with a giveaway funnel concept. First, what the heck is a giveaway funnel and how does it work to build my business? So for this example, I'm actually gonna use Veronica. Veronica is an Arbonne independent consultant as well as being a stellar member of the Branding Group team. And she has been in Arbonne for about two months now. And so for us to build her business, let's set the stage, right? Yes. You want people to jump in, yeah. you want people to buy the product first. If they see success with the product, then they may join the team. Correct. But they got to find the product first. They got to be passionate gotta, about the product, yeah. Yeah. right? So now we've also figured out that people like doing the product and joining in with you um, if they're in a group setting. Yeah, some kind of community. Yeah, if it's not just them. If it's like a Facebook group, a Facebook event, right. or something like a detox, for example. So yeah. that's what we're going to be doing. So Veronica joined Arbonne with her family when they were all doing a detox mm -hmm. together. So let's create the same thing, right? Let's duplicate that success. Yes. So the giveaway funnel is going to be for, number one, you're inviting people in to do a detox with you after the holidays. Number two, you are using a detox product as bait Correct. to get their name and email address right. so that you can find out who these people are. So the giveaway would be the product that they need to take part in this detox. Correct. So, and it's going to cost you about $30 to give the product away, right? Right, right. Right. So not a lot of cost involved for actually the product itself, right? So um, the only cost that would be involved really is just whatever you pay for setting up the funnel itself. Yeah, right. Yeah. So um, the giveaway funnel on page one. So I'm literally walking you through right now how to set up a giveaway funnel for your network marketing business. Page one, we talk about what we're doing. We give the dates and times if there's an yep. event tied to it. Um, and then we invite them to take part in this and, and get an opportunity to win if they enter in their name and email. So they enter their name and email. And on the second page, we're inviting them to share. Yeah. Right? Yeah, because we want them to share with their friends. And that gives them the opportunity to make it more of a community. Yes. I love it. I love it. So they enter in. So they, they're the, the whole draw is number one, a lot of people want, for your case, we're doing right. the detox, a lot of people want that. Right, after right? the holidays, that's a big deal. Yeah, <laughs> like, oh my gosh, I ate way too many cookies. <laughs> I need yeah. to go on a detox, I need to clean. parties this year. <laughs> yeah, but they also don't want to do it alone. Correct, yeah. And so creating an online community. Yeah, and it's um, accountability as well. Yes, yes. Um, so we've seen uh, companies like LuLaRoe do a yeah. phenomenal job just right. using Facebook groups. Yeah. And so on Jam the... Jamberry as well. They're another yes. one that does a lot of Facebook parties. Yes. Yes. So what I would recommend doing for a giveaway funnel for your network marketing company, on that page, after they've signed up mm -hmm. and they say, yes, I want to win, on the next page, thank them, give them the opportunity to share, uh -huh. but then also give them a quick link so they can dive into the Facebook group and take part. Yeah. Right? Because if they're going to do this detox with you, yeah. most likely they're going to buy Right, right. If they're going to sign up for a chance to win, that means they're pretty much ready to do it. Yeah, they're ready to go. Yeah. They're like, I could win it for free or I could just take part with you. Right. So um, now let's talk about building a team, mm -hmm. right? Because the people who want to take part in the detox with you, right? Some of them are going to be the those leaders that you want yes. that are going to do it themselves, right. right? So now for you, you became an independent consultant after telling the story about how well your detox was going, because that was one of the things that your your team did, right? Yeah. Is they encouraged you, share the results. Yeah. And what happened naturally? People were going, They're Veronica, interested. how can I do that? Right, right, yeah. You take before and after pictures, or you you know, uh, do measurements, or kind of jot down how you're feeling or what's going on. And then afterwards, you just talk about how you feel now, or what's happening now. Yeah. So then you tell everybody about it, and people, and usually health, is something that is attracted, attractive to a lot of people. Yes, definitely. Now, for you, um, you join the detox, uh -huh. and then as a result of you, you keeping accountable on social media, you are posting your own results. Yes. You are getting people going, Veronica, I see what you're doing. I see how that's working. How can I take part in this? Uh -huh. And you end up 
to the person who signed you up and said, all these people are yeah. asking. And then what, what happened? What do I do with this? And she was like, well, you could go ahead. She's like, I don't mind, you know, taking them and selling the product to them, but you can do this too. <laughs> you can sell it to them or, you know, be their consultant. And if anything, you're going to get discounts or you're going to get a kickback or whatever. So what do you think? And I was like, well, I mean, I really do know about social media. Yeah. <laughs> And I, but I believed in the product. I loved what it was, and I had passion for it. So I had no problem saying, "Okay, I can do this." Nice. I love it. I love it. So um, we get asked all the time, "How can I attract the leaders? How can I attract people that want to join my team?" And um, people who want to do their own business, a lot of them are already in business with each other, anyways, right? right? So right. they're doing something yeah. on the side already whether they're a real estate agent yeah. or they're already a salesman at some yeah. company, like they're already have that entrepreneurial spirit. Correct. So trying to light that fire in somebody that's not already doing it, uh -huh. that's a lot harder than just finding people who are already yeah. entrepreneurs, living it out, and then just having them join your team on the right. side as well. Right, because the person who I'm signed under, um, she's an entrepreneur herself. Yeah. She has like her, like another um, real job, I would say. <laughs> right, right. And then, um, and she has another business on the side. So this is like her second business on the side. So people like that, and then I come from a family who's full of entrepreneurs, so that is not hard for me either. Yeah, so finding those people, how do we find those people on Facebook? What are the things that we should look for and how do we attract them into the company, specifically using a giveaway funnel? My idea would be um, giving them something that they want that they could apply to their other businesses, Yeah. right? And yeah. then it just opens the door, right? So. Things like depending on if they're readers, uh -huh. you know, getting oh, them getting them books, book. yeah, yeah, that they that just came out, you know. Um, what other suggestions do you have for finding and attracting other entrepreneurs into your opportunity? Well, I mean, I think like okay, the branding group has a lot of tools for that, and I think yeah. um, depending on the person, like, well, you might want to say, hey, hey, branding group, like, can we buy this this from you and give it away? So maybe like the um, oh nice the uh, repin you yeah the Pinterest University Pinterest yeah. University that would be a great thing that they can say I want to buy a membership for that or even like a membership for our social media marketing that we do our certification classes that we do so things like that that would help them and not just this direct marketing but in other businesses that they have nice um, that's really good finding something that they could use in their other business mm -hmm. dangling that as the carrot so to speak sure yeah. And saying, if you join me, I'll give you this to help with your other businesses, and yeah, you'll have this one. business. Right. Yeah. That's that's good. I like that. I like that. Um, now, finally, let's let's close up this funnel Friday with these thoughts. Number one, a funnel. What is a funnel? It's a mini website that is used to bring people from a looker into a buyer. Right. So, um, also webinars. Yeah. We see them everywhere. Yes, always webinars. <laughs> One of the things that I love about webinars is it's something that you as a business owner can do. You can do it once, mm -hmm. record it, and then use it as a tool to help right. the people, right? So uh -huh. we do do that all the time. We have so many recorded webinars that we use to help tell people about what the difference is in working with the branding group. So right. how can a network marketer use a webinar to find and attract leaders? I think bringing somebody in that already knows your product well, yeah. and then having them kind of sitting with you or on the phone with you while they're going over the opportunity, because then you only have to use that leader's time once. Right. Yeah. You record the webinar and then say, hey, if you're interested in this, this yeah. is something that I did with so-and-so. Right. This tells you what we should do, uh -huh. right? So doing something like that um, uh, would be one way. I think even using your product, like, in the webinar kind of showing like how it works or whatever. Brilliant. Or yeah, how it works or wearing it or whatever. Um, I think that's a good way to use your webinar too. And um, your leader, like to attract that leader, showing a little bit of the opportunity of what the business part has done for you. Yeah, I because like that. they will see that. They're, and most of the time leaders, like people who are wanting to be a part of this business, they're gonna stick it out to the end. Yeah. And they're gonna see that and like, wait a minute. I think I can do that too. Nice, nice. And a webinar um, is something that you can duplicate. Yeah. And that's something if you're if you see someone who's like a rock star in their mm -hmm. business, you're like, I can't do it. I can't put that much time into it. 
you know, I, there's no way I could follow their example. Mm -hmm. But creating a system where you say, look, I have a system set up where you can do this yeah. just by following my example. That's a great right, way to find and attract right. leaders. So, Veronica, thank you so much for taking the time. We have a free toolkit for you if you're in the network marketing business. Download this toolkit, get it for you for yourself. We have a lot of software in there. We talk about the Pinterest University. Mm -hmm. um, we talk about webinars. So go grab that. If you have any other questions, feel free to reach out to us, 661-946-0888. We are excited to see your business explode in this new year.